Here I'm throwing bread into a certain area of water, hoping that it will motivate the common carp to feed. I did this for the first time about two weeks ago with the guys from Bass Holes Surf Casting. Doing this started what can best be described as a carp blitz. The surface eats were violent, competitive, and frequent. I had six carp excitedly eat my white marabou fly that day. Since then, I've tried to recreate that experience many times to no avail. If you don't handle the bread too much, it'll float, and you might see some awesome surface action. These first bunch of bread balls are pretty lightly squeezed, so they float. If you squeeze the bread into tight balls, they will sink. The last few pieces I throw here are sinkers. Those are the ones that motivated these carp to eat my fly today. I hooked a real nice carp in the chummed area early on, but it jumped and threw the hook. I kept casting and eventually had another eat on a size 12 white marabou fly. The carp will often see the fly hit the water and strike it as it sinks. After I cast, I try to collect my slack line without pulling the fly away from where it landed. If the line jerks downwards, you probably got a bite. If the line jerk doesn't occur during the drop, I'll collect my line slowly with short, swift twitches. The carp will often strike the marabou fly after a quick twitch. For some reason, they're usually willing to chase down marabou flies and strike them pretty viciously.